Hey everyone, so welcome to the Climbing Nomads YouTube channel. Today we're going to give you guys a few tips on uh, how to use a clip stick. So, clip stick's a really useful tool for sport climbing. Uh, it can be used in lots, in a few different ways. But the way it's most commonly used is to get your rope, get the quick draw on the rope into the first bolt of a climb. Indoors, the landings are good and the first bolts are really close to the ground, but outdoors, sometimes the first bolt is quite high, the landings aren't very good, so you, you really don't want to fall off without having the rope in. What we're going to do is we're going to get our quick draw and our clip stick and we're going to put the top carabiner of our quick draw into the clip stick with the spine in the groove and then we're going to push the gate open and lock that into the retaining clasp there. So that's going to hold that carabiner nice and securely and keep the gate open. Next thing we're going to do, we're going to get our climbing rope. We're going to work out which end of the rope is going to be the climber's end and pull a load of slack through. And we're going to pre clip that into the bottom of the runner. So now, what we're going to do is we're going to start extending the, the clip stick up and keeping hold of the rope as we go so that it feeds a little bit better. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to line it all up and I'm going to hook the quick draw into the bolt. And then once it's hooked in, I'm just going to gently pull down on the clip stick. We should leave the quick draw hanging in place with our rope attached. And just going to double check that it's all clipped the right way and our climber's end is going to be coming out the top of the quick draw. So if the second bolt of the route was also quite spaced and again there was a risk of a ground fall if I fluffed up clipping that second bolt, I would potentially as well clip stick the second bolt as well. For me, sport climbing is all about climbing as safely as I can. Um, so if there's a danger or a risk of me potentially decking out, then I'm just going to use the clip stick, get the rope in there before before I leave the ground. Makes it nice and safe. So it might be a situation where there's a quick draw already in the bolt that you need to get your rope into. Maybe you've done a red point, you've fallen off, but you've pulled the rope back through and the rope's come all the way down to the ground and you want to get the rope back in. So to clip the rope in when the draw's already in place, what we're going to do is we're going to get our our rope, pull a load of slack through and we're going to push a bite of rope through the top of the clip stick, leaving ourselves like a little loop in here and we're going to make sure that the uh, the climbers end of the, that we know which end is the climbers end of the rope so that we, when we clip the quick draw we're making sure we clip the quick draw the right way around. So what I'm going to do now is extend the clip stick and as I extend it I need to keep moving the rope up. So I've extended the clip stick now and I've got all the rope. I'm going to try and get the bottom carabiner of the quick draw to fit through the, the loop of rope that we've created and then when it's in line I'm going to start pulling on the rope so that it squeezes itself into that carabiner. So once it's clipped in, I can then just pull my clip stick down out the way. And we've got our rope in there. And then I'm just going to double check that we've got the climber's end coming out the top of the, uh, the quick draw. There we are, ready to climb. So that's just a couple of ways that you can use your clip stick to help keep yourself a little bit safer when you're sport climbing. Hope you found that useful. Um, if you've got any questions, then leave us a comment below and we'll do our best to answer those. 
and do check out our other videos so we do vlogs about our own adventures other climbing tutorials and gear reviews see you in the next one and subscribe if you haven't already bye